just wanted him to be happy and get to the space where he wanted to. And yes, I was in a dark space. I lost myself in him. Okay? Welcome to another edition of Spit the Tea. But we try to give you the tea exactly how we got it. We spit it right back at you the same way. Up, girl? You got some tea for me? I mean... What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. We on the Queen and Clarence publicity run for Queen's new album, Misunderstood. Nah, I'm just joking. Anyway, it's your girl, Messy Monique, man. Getting here to spit some mess, man. This thing's get deep. Clarence and his ex going at it. Chris jumped in the middle trying to be, I don't know, relevant. And this thing just done got so crazy, crazy out of hand that... This girl don't spill all kind of tea on Queen. She don't do hits at Queen. She just, she's hurt. She want to cry every day. She don't know what to do. She in and out of relationships. And Queen and Clarence been holding still. I see like that's her and Chris, Chris problem for real, for real. It's like, well, dang, they still together, but they were supposed to be together on a business relationship. Or they still together, but they supposed to just be friends. Hey, sometimes friends turn into a relationship. Anyway, that's enough. This is me talking rant. Like, comment, subscribe, man. Listen to this first part of this girl talking about this diss track. And tell me what y'all think below. No, I know. And I know when a girl wants what she wants, she's gonna get it. <laughs> she gonna try. Some way, somehow. But... I also held on to what his mom said to me. I also held on to what she said. And she said more things that I'm not going to say because it's not necessary. You sure? Okay? It's not necessary for me to say. So, I'm going to just leave that there. But she did tell me that. That's, that's not his type. You're his type. Yada, yada, yada. And I was like, okay, I guess. Mom's low key said Clarence don't like black women. <laughs> nah, that's a little mess shape. Man, mama just trying to keep you calm so you don't go break up her basement. The diss track? I've never made a diss track. Does it even look like I would make a diss track? I don't got bars. You were lame. Just doing this to get things. Now you think you got all the game. But it will never be the same. Can you go from Leslie the same? Somebody who's a grade A. And is always in the shade. Now you stop trying to skate. Cause you know. Queen is a fiend. <laughs> I don't know she might never make the diss track. You know, good to good to good to where her family did. And they was taken up for her. Right, let's get to this. I, I don't I don't rap. I don't have time for that. That is not my specialty. Why would I even do that? I'm people make their own the whole internet was making their own assumptions and they were critiquing and giving their own opinions or whatever. And if somebody and anybody in my family wanted to do something like that, that's their business. I had nothing to do with it. And I I sure as hell did not write this book, but it's talking sh about me, okay? And I have every right to say something, okay? I have every right to say something, and you didn't even have to react to it, but you did. And I felt like I wanted to react to it too. And maybe when I was reacting to it, my storyline didn't, it made crazy speculations and I was, misconstrued a, f a few times or whatever because I was just going along with the book and what was popping up in my head what I remembered what better way to take advantage of the space that we were in to take advantage of the fact that he never had a kid but you you did you have a baby and you are an experienced woman you know what it, what it takes to have a baby us women, we all track our ovulation. I'm pretty sure you did too. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure she tracked her ovulation, her her menstrual. I'm pretty sure she knew when she was ovulating and when she was most fertile. Like you're not you're not just gonna 
sleep with somebody and just not know. You was moving very maliciously, very maliciously. And for that, I can't forgive you. You had a husband, figure it out with him. Yeah, he did you wrong. And you was going through the share of things that you was going through, but so was I. And the same thing that you was going through, you did it to me. And the crazy part about this is, you didn't even know him. But from the moment that you slid into his DM, you was plotting on him. You knew exactly what you was doing. But it's okay. She said, Queen, try the trap, Claire. Ah! Anyway, listen. That girl probably wasn't tracking her ovulation because I don't think she planned to get pregnant. But she planned to trap him some kind of way. And she made it pretty good because he said it. Anyway, that girl said, Queen trapped him. Her feelings are so, 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 so hurt. She ain't gonna get over this, but she had multiple boyfriends since that whole point. But she just, she not gonna get over it. Because Clarence looked like a superstar. And she stuck in that relationship, as I said before. But, y'all know Queen ain't finna keep quiet. She said, this is right before my album. Best moments always happen between that. She's like, we definitely about to run it up in the basement videos. With, but we, be we definitely about to run it up with some basement videos. But in the basement of their own. She got her. She a big tipper. He a big spender. Well, let's see how this goes. Y'all like, comment, subscribe to my channel.